Hey everyone, welcome to Wednesday's Sign of the Week. So over the past few weeks, we've been busy learning some people signs. Mostly signs for people that might be in your family. So if you didn't catch any of those, you can scroll back through our uh, feed to find the videos, or you can look us up on YouTube. So all of our Sign of the Week and Story of the Week and all of our shared story time videos are now on our YouTube page. So you can look it up and create links if you need to. So today I thought we might do some signs for some community workers. I'm gonna show you the sign for community because it's one that I really like. So you're gonna take your flat hands, you're gonna put them together almost in a bit of a triangular shape, like your hands are touching, and you're gonna move them across your body. Community workers. So there's lots of great people that work in our community. You might be teaching some children about the different helpers that we have in our community. So the first one that we're going to do is the sign for teacher. So you're gonna take this shape with your dominant hand. I'm a right-hander, so my right hand is my dominant hand. And you're gonna move it back and forward around the top of your head, around the side of your head area, maybe around your temple. So shake it or wiggle it back and forward. Teacher. The next sign is the sign for dentist. So there are a couple of alternatives for this one as well. I'm gonna be using this one today. So you're gonna make this hand shape. It's a little bit like hang loose, isn't it? You're gonna put your thumb out and move it around, almost like it's drilling, I guess, into your teeth or moving towards your teeth. Dentist. So teacher, dentist. The next sign that we're going to do is the sign for nurse. So there are a couple of alternatives for the sign for nurse. Some of them make reference to the old school hats that nurses used to wear. Um, but as we no longer have nurses generally wearing those hats, I like to do the sign like this by making a cross on the top of your arm. You might also see that one done for hospital or patient, nurse. And what goes with a nurse? Maybe a doctor. So you're gonna take your two fingers, put them together, stretch your thumb out and you're going to Put them onto your wrist or grab your wrist. Almost like you're checking your pulse, I guess. Doctor. And the last one that we're gonna to learn today has a bit of a similar handshake. It's the sign for police, police officer. So we're gonna take those two fingers, we're gonna slap them onto our wrist, a little bit like some handcuffs, and then you're gonna flip them off or slide them off your hand. Police, police. So let's go through those community worker signs. We've got teacher and dentist and nurse and doctor and police or police officer. Thanks for joining us today for Wednesday's Sign of the Week. And I look forward to doing some singing with you next time where we can use some of those people signs or community worker signs. See you then.